Good morning, or afternoon, or evening, depending on what time you're tuning in. Um, I built a second large room on top of the first large room because I wanted to put in the glass roof. So there's the glass roof. Needed a lot of glass for that, but it's quite nice. Not much to see at the moment. But, uh, yeah. Nice. And today... I want to go to the second architect beacon. Because I did notice after I collected the first one, um, that switched off and the second one's active. So I would very much like to go and do that. Um, oh. Uh, I was gonna. I was gonna eat. I think we're good. I think we're good. Uh, yeah, let's let's go. I don't know exactly how far down this is, or even how far it is. I can't see the beacon now. Where's the beacon? Oh, there we go. Artifact, architect body. That's where I want to go. and see if we can find that. Hey. If you see that, you're on the right track. Um, it's another pillar. those things. Yeah, we have to contend with that. We're getting closer. Only 150 meters. So close. Oh, it's this one. No, I've been here before. Aha! Right, we're safe to park here. Well, perhaps we should go a little bit closer. Yeah. of nice stuff. Ancient ornamental plant. Was the actual piece of the architect. Ah, okay. Excellent. The skeleton is fully bent, able to handle heavy forces. I got a frame for my uniform. Are you okay, Alan? It is not often that I gaze upon the form of a fallen architect. Is this place another sort of sanctuary? As the bacterium spread, the continuation of life became uncertain. This is a place to reflect. I think I understand. We have 
found two of the three components required for the construction of my corporeal form. This is as close as I have come to autonomy for a long time. You have such a way with words. Is that sarcasm? It was. You're learning. Hopefully, I will not have time to complete my study. <laughs> I was wondering, if you can transfer bodies, why was it important to find a cure when you were infected? Couldn't you just make a new body? As you can see in the components you have scanned thus far, the forms we require combine biological and mechanical parts. The tissues you have scanned were developed from the DNA of 27 separate alien species. 27? That seems greedy. And wouldn't that mean that anything that infects a body you've manufactured can potentially learn how to infect all those other species? Yes. That is why a cure was inherent. Okay, two out of three pieces, that's good going. I'm going to get back to the main part of the sea truck and then go and investigate the new artifact. Okay, let's just uh, drink some water, eat some food. There we go. This is leading back to the mining site. Artifact could provide useful information. Processing. I can visualize a location where we may find an important component for my body. The image is hazy, but I am sure it is correct. A stark surface landscape, dangerously cold. Curved spires stretch to the sky. Okay, I think the safest route back is now going to be out of the, um, the mine entrance. Alright, cool. Oh. Father humans cope with the loss of memories. Like forgetting someone's birthday? I don't know, it just happens. When you die, some quantity of knowledge is lost forever to the next generation. Isn't that... I'm warning you, if you call humanity inefficient one more time, I will swim us both into the mouth of a leviathan. Is that sarcasm? I am still having trouble differentiating. How inefficient? Efficiency aside, does the loss of knowledge not create complications? Well, on a personal level, losing someone can be traumatic. But it's harder to process the idea of generational knowledge. Humans aren't networked, so we can't even be aware of what we're losing moment by moment. We try to learn from history. Maybe it's not ideal, but it's what we have. What happens when you no longer have the memories of others to combine with your own? You make your own memories and interpretations. You have to experience life as an autonomous being. Discover yourself. That idea is foreign to me. Thank you. 
Okay, here we are. What happens as you are sleeping? I was being pulled from a logical world to a logical world, with you at the center of them. I was dreaming. The brain processes in mysterious ways when we sleep. Does it serve a purpose? It was such disorienting and fragmented thought. Random images and sensations. No one is completely sure what it does. There are theories, but every human dreams. Many other mammals, too. Is it enjoyable? It can be. We can experience impossible joy, and also impossible terror in our dreams. Sometimes I can fly. Sometimes I call out to Sam and can't reach her. Sometimes I'm in my underwear, defending my doctoral thesis. It's a mixed bag. Your biofeedback indicates that flying is the most enjoyable dream. I therefore hope you have many more of those. Mainly for my own safety. Oh wow. Eek. data patterns are so strong here. There is almost certainly vital information pertaining to my body construction nearby. And there it is. Of course, you know what comes next, don't you? Once I've got this, probably back to that fabricator. Oh, look, iron cubes. Yay! Any more? Any more? The cold preserved the body well, but this isn't a big sample. Will it be enough? Our tissues are pluripotent, derived from the DNA of various species, capable of changing form as necessary. Ah, like stem cells. So, what prevents you from Ooh, know, looky there. ending up with hooves where your eyelashes should go? That does not happen. At least not since the fourth iteration. You have scanned all the components we need to make a storage, uh, body. Are you excited? Using the chemical compounds available in your body, I am able to approximate what you might call cautious optimism.
Okay, need to get back to base and um, find out exactly what I need to be building that. God, there's snowstalkers here as well. What the hell? now <laughs> health down to 40 oh this isn't good oh they're still coming got to be kidding is anywhere safe here Look at that. Hmm. We're still at the spires. Oh god. No! That's not going to help. Down to 37 already. Oh, no way. Back at the spires. Haven't even got past the spires. There's an ice cave. No! <laughs> Alone, you big meanie. What's the matter with you? Oh, okay. Made it back. Uh, better park the bike. Needs repairs and needs recharging. It's an adventure, isn't it? Welcome aboard, Captain. We have gathered the necessary components to begin constructing my body. Great! What's next? Let's get you out of my head. First, you must find the fabrication facility. It is concealed at some depths. Fabrication facility. 
So you planned on needing to make new bodies? It is a standard medical facility. A medical facility where you just replace your whole body when it wears out? Sounds a little beyond standard to me. Ours was a research mission of the highest importance. So, what were you, a scientist like me? I am a scientist now. So, what happened? Your team found the vaccine and then... Please, Robin, you have the components. Find the facility and construct the body. Okay, but don't think I don't notice you changing the topic. Hmm. It's a bit insistent, isn't he? see what we need architect tissues root pustule synthetic fibers and gel sats not too bad polyaniline three diamonds plastils all right iron cube ribbon plant and kyanite I think I might have three kyanite can't remember off the top of my head uh, I'll have to go back to the main base and have a look but for now uh, I think I'm going to call it there and we shall continue and construct the architect body uh, soon, very very soon. So thank you for tuning in. Bye bye.